near you, fella. God be with you, good sir. What are you hanging around for? Don't you have any work to do? No, I don't. Sigismund's marauders took everything I had and reduced me to beggary. What's it about? Since I lost everything, I've been doing whatever I could to survive. So you're a pickpocket? My honestly begged Russian were taken from me by that bastard of a guard, Hasdera. Well, if you can get them from his pocket back into mine, where they rightfully belong, I'll give you a share and teach you a handy trick too. All right. I reckon I can manage that. Everything he has on him. Half is yours. Hmm. Well, take it or leave it. May the Lord watch over you. God be with you. I'm here for training. There's nothing I can do for you here. Very well, sir. Take care now. See you survived. Aren't you observant? You still owe me. Don't think I've forgotten. I don't owe you. I owe your father, and he's dead. So get out of here. You can't avoid this forever, you know. Of course I can. It's you who can't piss me off forever. Do you really want to make me angry? You really think that's wise? No, I don't. Fine, I owe you. And what am I supposed to do about it? Look at what I've got. But maybe I could... Maybe I could tell you where you can find some money. If you forgive my debt, that is. All right, then. Start talking. No. First, I want you to swear you won't be the man... Very well, then. Talk. When we were running from Scalets, I heard something. I don't know who said it. Either way, somebody hid a lot of coin under a dovecot. Under a dovecot? And that's it? That's all I know. How many dovecots could there be in Scalets? Fine. God save you. Would you teach me something about the, uh, milling craft? Aye. Why not? You're handy enough. Take care. Hey, I'll stand here and pretend I don't know you're there. You try sneaking up behind me without me seeing you and take something from my purse. First, you have to rummage in the purse. The longer you do it, the better chance you have of finding something valuable, but also of getting caught in the act. Once you've found something you want, you've got to pull it out carefully, but fast enough so I don't notice. Try stealing my dagger. It's there, mixed up with other things.
caught you. If this was for real, I'd be yelling for a guard. Try it again. Caught you. If this was for real, I'd be yelling for a guard. Try it again. the way. I hardly noticed you were there. I think you're ready to try it out for real. Best practice on drunks and sleeping folk, so you don't end up in jail before you even get started. Thanks, Pashek. You're welcome. But I'll be having that dagger back now. Sit down. Good day. Bait. And stay out of sight. What will people think if they see me talking to a vagabond like you? God bless. Fred Beach, just this morning. Fred!
Jesus Christ be praised. Master Bailiff, is there anything of interest going on here? Don't even talk to me. I want to learn to read. Who should I go and see? There's a retired scribe in Ujits. He could teach you. Take care. What the fuck?
My respects to you. Do you know if there's anyone around here who could use my help? I've got other things on my mind. Do you know if there's any... I've got other... Can we do something about the... Sure. What? Agree? A nice thought. See you now. Good day to you. What do you need? Let's have a word about the price. Aye. Satisfied? That sounds... Agree? A nice sum. That's a sum.
Good health to you. I'm here for training. Yes, you're that boy Sir Ratzik said. Yes, that's me. Let's get to it then, because that's what Sir Ratzik wishes. Uh, and because you've never held a sword in your hand before, we'll start with something simple. Very well. Come with me and listen closely. I don't want to be... Take care now. So let's see what you're made of. Hold it properly and keep moving. Never stand still when your life depends on it. Right, good. Now, try attacking. You've got to put your back into a good slash. No use waving the sword around like you're swatting flies. Go into the attack with your whole body. Try slashing from various sides to get used to it. Nice. Well done. All right. All right. Well done. That pointy tip isn't for decoration. Try stabbing me with it a few times. Not bad. Very good. Good. That will do. Slashing, stabbing, and movement are the foundations that you build everything else on. Now, let's try something more complicated. One strike, I can simply fend off. You mustn't give your opponent time to react. String your strikes together. As soon as you finish one, begin another. Strike, strike, strike. Not bad. Now let's see how you do with defense. It's not hard to block a basic strike. Just watch out and move your sword into the path of the blow. Well done. Nice. Well done. Not bad. Very well then. Let's see what you're made of, lad. Come at me and don't hold back. Good strike. Fine. That's enough. I have my work cut out, it seems. That's life. Let's try something more advanced. When in combat, keep an eye on the space between you and your opponent. That is your space. Try to attack from the side the opponent will find harder to block in time. If I'm holding the sword raised up, do an uppercut. If my sword is low, lunge. Let's try it. You strike a few times at the side where I'm not holding my sword. Ah, that's it! Nice. Ah, that's it. Well done. All right. Right. Lesson two. Everything you've learned about blocking is wrong. When I cover, I can simply fend off your blows with my sword and gain control of the space between us. But it's better not to control just the space, but actually your opponent's weapon. Attack, and I'll show you. Yeah. Ow. 
All right, that will do. Now you. The trick is to stay in your stance. As soon as I start to attack, you block. The move knocks the blade aside. No, not like that. You mustn't hold the sword there. You have to move along with the attack. Again. It's too soon again. All right. Oh. Ah, that's it. Try it a little faster. Concentrate and block just at the moment I start attacking. I'll strike you from above each time so you can see it well. Not bad. Not bad. Ah, that's it. Good. Now let's try it at full speed. You probably won't succeed, but that's normal at the start. You must train. Let's go. Sir Hans, what brings you? I was on my way when I noticed that you're entertaining Sir Radzig's esteemed guest. Not the same as holding a hammer, is it, blacksmith? It's Sir Radzig's orders. I know. I'm actually here to train at the archery range. My hand's grown heavy lately. You don't mind, do you, Bernard? Not at all, my lord. Good day to you, blacksmith's boy. Try not to hurt yourself. Where did we finish? Yeah, leading the opponent where you want him. There's one more way to evade a strike. You simply step aside, attack, and I'll show you. All right, try it. It's important not to move too soon. I'll see where you're going and hit you. That the same will happen if you move too late. I'll attack slowly now. As you see me, raise the weapon, jump us up. You'll throw the opponent off a bit, and there's your chance. Wrong! Again! Not like that! Very good! Not bad. Not bad. Fine. Try it a little quicker. Try and get used to the rhythm. Never take your eyes off your opponent. You'll see a strike before it's even properly started. Not bad. Good. Very good. And the last thing for today, a trick. You raise the sword to force your opponent to block. But then, change the direction of the attack at the last moment, and the opponent won't even know what hit him. Try it. Draw back the weapon, then change the attack zone and strike, so I don't have time to react. Ah, that's it! Not bad! 
Well done. Yeah. Very good. Mm. Wrong, damn it. Wah. Very good. Well now, that wasn't too bad. Maybe we'll make a soldier of you after all. But don't get cocky. You have to train hard and persistently. You might have talent, but talent alone won't do. Practice. Whenever you've got nothing better to do and you're in the mood for it, you can come and train here with me. I can teach you something more when you're up to it. Don't leave yet. Sir Radzig also wanted me to teach you archery. Come with me.